So I heard about the fashion hackathon, and I decided to rock up and finally do my idea. And this top is the worst top in the world, but I thought that I would be the beta bird guys by wearing this today. So I apologize. I'm going to flash everybody by accident, which I'm doing right now. So, yeah. Um, a little bit. You're good. So, <laughs> so uh, essentially, I used to want to be able to, oh, thank you. I used to want to do this in Flash, and Flash is not cool anymore, so I decided to do it in JavaScript this time. Um, I came in yesterday with a sewing machine, and I started sewing leather shoes custom made for this and I broke my sewing machine. Oh. So <laughs> there's been a lot of issues, um, and it's probably gonna have issues running it now, but I'm just really excited because I finally got to do this, and uh, I can't wait to show off how annoying it is. So I just wanted to <laughs> apologize for all of the meows that everyone heard over the last two days as well. <laughs> um, the screen's not working. I need the screen. <laughs> that could be why. That could be why. So um, I built this in Node.js, and it's also using Chrome's uh, web audio context, um, cutting edge stuff. So like Node didn't want to play with web context, um, sorry, web audio context, and vice versa. And uh, yeah, I need to plug that in. All right. Um, and then I also have like a sketch running on my Arduino, and the Arduino takes the pressure sensors in my shoes and figures out whether or not I'm standing up or not. That's a little bit dodgy right now, so uh, I might be doing beats that I don't mean to. And why is this like this? Sorry, this is terrible. Roast. Node.js as well as a, a ton of libraries. Um, so if you look at the libraries, it's using Web Audio API, the Abbey Load helper. Abbey Load is awesome for uh, Web Audio context. Just lets you like um, queue up sounds, which is really cool. Uh, Node.js, of course. I'm using Bopper, which is like a little node, kind of it's barely even a module, um, and kind of bastardized that. Uh, I'm using Browserify, which just allows me to require stuff. I'm using Socket.io, which basically allows the um, server to communicate with the like the serial connection. I'm also using serial port, and they talk to each other. So hopefully it works. Um, so I'm just going to start up my node server. And what else do I need to do? I need to go to my local host. Whoop, I got my feet up. So I'm just going to freestyle it. So apologies, I didn't really get time to do a good interface. <laughs> so, so, still can't quite tell when I'm standing, but it's good. So I have a drum mode as well. Okay, let's stop that, let's stop that. All right. Let's stop. Okay. <laughs> so the standing standing algorithm needs some work. So essentially, um, essentially, I have a freestyle mode, and there's a metronome as you can hear, and it helps you like place the beats. So it's 16 beats, and then I can just <laughs> so I can just like you know, and I have four different sounds: one for uh, two for the toes, two for the heels. And it, every time you make a sound, it cues it up. And then every time it plays that sound, it will show a visual of what you did. <laughs> Is there any way we can turn this up at all? No way? OK. It's loud. It's all right? OK. Uh, I also have voice mode. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. And there's a 
magic a stop button, which is awesome. <laughs> it was one of the first things I implemented was that stop button. So if I want to just freestyle and not having it sequencing up, I can't actually be silly now. So. And, oh look, it knows I'm standing. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, awesome. And then the voices. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Combat, 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 combat. <laughs> And uh, that's pretty much it. Yeah. <laughs> if, if you want to see how bad the fuck is, it's pretty terrible. But it was a lot of fun. Yeah. It, the second version will be all wireless and all nicely done. Wait, wait, let's see if I can. Oh, I can't get it to stand. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get a stand. So yeah, it's a little fidgety to stand. It kind of, if both are pushed down at the same time, it, it knows that you're standing, but I think the placement of the, the sensors needs a little adjustment, so. I think we all have a lot of questions. Anyway, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Anybody have any questions? Okay. Sorry. <laughs> How long have you been awesome? And when is that start? Um, I just call it weird. <laughs> um, I've been weird for a very long time. Um, again, I've, I've wanted to do this for four years. And every time I told somebody, they're like, hmm. <laughs> so um, I'm a member of the local hack space. I tend to just do silly things. I haven't been able to work on a personal project for myself for a couple of years because I'm, I'm part of the downtown community helping out. So this was a very indulgent time for me. And trust me, I'm not very impressive. This is one of the first things I've done in quite a while. So. What's your day job? You My day job is I'm a front end developer at Zappos, so I think I got the culture probably down. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Thank you, though, for that compliment. Yes. Uh, another question, just a suggestion. Yeah, that would be sweet. That would be amazing. Like you can get like flexible resistors, so when you flex your arm, if it's across your arm, yeah, it should be able to make like a one-man band. Yeah, that's awesome. Thank you. Yes. So <laughs> the classic thing was like I, I mean, I don't know if everyone saw me doing the hackathon, but I was like very had my do not disturb face on. I was like, ah, ah, wet body, oh god damn it. Um, so I only just finished in time, and I didn't actually get to learn how to use the thing. And uh, obviously, I need to tweak the standing a bit more too. So yes, I would love to actually finally get a choreographed and like an, a, like a more official looking video. Thank you. Did you work with anybody? Um, so Pablo helps me so much with debugging. Like he actually took a lot of time out of his project, so I feel like I stole some of his time to uh, to a degree. And he was wonderful. So every time I was just like, I don't know. For those who hung back late last night, we were standing there going meow, 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 meow. We were trying to figure it out. So he was wonderful, and it's really useful having two heads to talk about problems when you have them. Um, but the rest, like the soldering and everything, I just kind of threw it together. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah.